joined now by George Sablon, the Veteran Outreach Coordinator, to talk about the Six Women Veterans Conference. Thanks for joining us, George. Thank you for having me. So what is uh, this conference and what can people expect? Well, this year we're hosting the um, Six Women's Veteran Conference. Um, it's, a, it's an annual event that um, the Department of Veteran Affairs sponsors every year. Um, this year's, uh, this year's, <laughs> sorry, this year is uh, the Women's Education, Women's Empowerment. And uh, we have a, a, a line list of uh, guest speakers that will be there with 10. Um, it's on Friday, March 2nd, 2012, from 8 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. What are some of the activities that uh, participants can expect? Well, we're going to be having a lot of guest speakers. Um, our keynote speaker will be Major Esther Aggie from the Guam Army National Guard. Um, she's going to go ahead and talk about her experiences being a female in the military, being a service member, current service member at that, and as well as a veteran. Um, we're also going to be having different professionals from um, educational and leadership and um, um, pretty much all military service backgrounds. We're going to be having Mary Okada from the Guam Community College. We're going to be having speakers from um, financial institutions. So pretty much, um, in a nutshell, we're going to see what other services aside from the Department of Veteran Affairs are available to, to current service members and veterans. Why is it important that we host such conferences and how has it proven to be effective uh, in the past? Well, um, a lot of times, especially now during, the, during the, these, these times of conflict, um, we, we're getting a lot of service members coming back from deployments or even trainings over an extended period of time and um, they, they are entitled to uh, certain services. Mm -hmm. And um, not a lot of them know or are in tune with what these services can provide for them. So by hosting these, uh, these, these types of conferences every year, um, it allows us to give them more insight to the services and what the service can benefit them um, in the long run. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I think at the last one there was some testimony, uh, some recordings, right, that we got to hear some stories from some uh, female veterans. And uh, well, yes, there, there are different, um, there are different veterans who come out and they do their own testimonials, their experiences, um, just like today, uh, just like this, this upcoming conference for Major Aggie, she's been deployed three times, I believe, um, right. overseas. So it's going to be um, a very a very different um, outlook coming from a, a female in such a high position to talk about her experience and her her um, her growing up in the military as far as, uh, as far as that's concerned. And we hope to see many of the different uh, service members from the Army, through the Coast Guard to the Navy, Marines, as well as the Air Force, to come out and um, share with them to to be uh, to share their experiences and to um, just pretty much uh, network. Definitely a well-needed event for uh, those serving in our military today. Oh, definitely. Uh, anything else you'd like to add? Oh uh, yes. Well, we'd like to thank our sponsors. Um, being that this is our sixth annual. Um, uh, event uh, we, we can't do without any of the support of the community, especially uh, Department of Veteran Affairs, Guam Pet Center, uh, Unique Pacific Resources, who pretty much holding the helm for the, the event this year, uh, Department of Labor's Women Bureau of Affairs, um, of course, West Care, too, um, the company that we work for, um, Amway, Delso, Guam Family Support 360, and um, there'll be a, those are who we have right now for our vendors. Okay. And uh, we expect more um, to come um, in the next week before the conference is, uh, before it starts, yes. Why don't you just invite them one more time to this conference and if they want to participate, where they need to call, who they need to contact. Okay, well although uh, this is the, the Women's Veteran Conference, this, this is actually open to every everyone, every service member, um, past, present, and of course future if you're interested. Uh, you may contact myself, George Sablon or Jeanette Sudo at 472-0219.